In Knights of Glory, you play as one of the king's knights, advancing through a treacherous dungeon by using the art of deception and deduction. You seek the ultimate goal of exiting the dungeon first and becoming the Royal Games victor. Knight of Glory is played in rounds, each consisting of three phases, action, voting, and refreshing. When advancing, look at the tier path ahead of you. If the tier path is face down, flip it over to see what obstacle you must overcome. You will roll the weapon dice and try to match the dice with your weapon cards by placing them face down. During the voting phase, opponents will cast their votes. If you were telling the truth or bluffing, and all your opponents agreed, then you will not have to reveal your cards and get to advance forward. Now, if you were telling the truth, any opponents that disagreed, you must reveal your cards. Then you get to advance forward, and any opponents that disagreed must retreat backwards. Now, if you were bluffing, then you must retreat backwards. And alternatively, the opponents that disagreed will get to advance forward. Throughout the game, there are many ways that help make advancing easier, such as playing a wild card for a die, performing a substitution, playing a Knights of Glory token, or even rolling blanks so you don't have to play a card. When a player successfully advances to the exit path, the tier paths will gradually collapse, starting with the start in all of tier one together. Any players that successfully advance to the exit path during this phase are considered winners as well. So, do you have what it takes to exit the dungeon first and win the Royal Games?